All right, this is a classic case of every action has an equal and opposite reaction. Demand for adjustable rate mortgages or ARMS has suddenly surged to a 14 year high as home buyers face some of the highest mortgage rates seen in more than a decade. Today's average rate for a 30 year fixed mortgage has just hit 5.57%, that according to bank rate. That's up seven basis points just over the last week. Mortgage applications, this is kind of a quick rush in because these things are only going higher. They also rose up 4.5% last week compared to the week before. Still nearly 8% lower than the rate for applications a year ago. FinTech company Goodleap, what they do is they help Americans not only finance their home loan, but also they, they loop in home sustainability projects like solar panels, smart thermostats, water saving turf, things like that. CEO and founder Hayes Barnard is joining me in a Fox Business exclusive. Uh, wow, what's your world like with these rising rates right now? Well, we're in good shape, to be honest with you. Yes, the cost of capital is going up, but the demand for consumers to take control of their energy needs has never been higher. You know, homeowners want to protect themselves. They want to lock their cost of energy in for the next 25 to 30 years. And they can do that by thoughtfully financing a number of items in the home to electrify the home, but also save the money from the very first month. So imagine like solar or battery storage or energy efficient HVAC, Liz. It really allows them to be thoughtful about how to take control all those energy needs. Man, I'm looking at uh, the CPI numbers and, and we, we break them out. I mean, all of energy year over year up 30% as far as prices are concerned. Uh, fuel, other oils up 58%. So obviously, if you can go into things that are less expensive, great. But what you offer, how is that saving me money and when do I start seeing the savings? Yeah, so imagine the world. This is the big misnomer. Everyone thinks that these are expensive or, uh, you know, solar is only for the wealthy. It's not true. We've democratized this. 32% of our business is below um, the average median income. And so what's really important to understand is you can be thoughtful about replacing that sad, outdated uh, water heater that's powered on fuel or a heating solution that's powered on fuel, or you could put solar on your roof and battery storage. Your home goes up in value instantaneously. And here's the part that I really want to make sure people understand. You save money from the very first month. You know, if you replace these solutions, you save $50 to $100 a month instantaneously. And, and you're fixing that energy cost over a 25 to 30 year period of time. And you're spot on. 32% is what energy costs overall in the United States went up over the last year. 9% just for that electricity yeah, I bill. I get it. I know. I mean, yeah. a natural gas, I mean, when you look at utility, natural gas service up 22.7% in this latest CPI reading year over year. You know, your latest round of fundraising in October, you're not public yet, but you have some pretty big hefty fans. Michael Dell is, is in here. Uh, Byron Trott, who was a big Buffett guy, you know, um, he, of course, yeah. is uh, with BDT Capital. They value your company right now at $12 billion. Uh, they want their money back eventually. Is there an IPO in your near future? Look, I, I will always do what's in the best interest of our shareholders like Michael Dell and Byron Trott, in addition to our employees. Right now, I think you would agree, a lot of the companies that IPO'd last year or late last year, they're trading below their IPO price. There's distractions. It's, it's very um, you know, confusing for those employees. I made a decision thoughtfully to raise some capital last year, remain private, focus on offensive strategies that allow us to gain market share. And we're going to gain a lot of market share this year. We're going to see significant growth this year. There's so much demand coming from okay. various product manufacturers that are trying to figure out how to, how to finance these items. Hey, so we got to run, but I'm very interested. You know, arms have suddenly become very hot, and especially with millennials or Gen Zers, more likely, who are trying yeah. to get into home ownership. How do you bundle in? What is the cost for bundling in something like this? So the first thing I would say is you don't have to touch that first mortgage. You can do an instantaneous point of sale consumer finance loan um, at extremely low rates, and you don't have to touch that first mortgage. Um, now, if you want to touch that first mortgage, uh, you know we do have the ability to take our consumer finance loans and roll them in uh, to that mortgage. Okay. But as you alluded to in the segment before, mortgage rates have gone from you know below three percent in November and December Five to five point five percent. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Hayes, um, thank you. We're, we're watching it, and I'll be very interested to see how a company like yours rolls with the punches of rising rates. Thanks. Great. Thank you, Liz. Appreciate it.